Thanks. Hope everything turns out okay. Good luck. Mr. Jameson? <laughs> oh, yeah, that was a good one. <laughs> Mr. Jameson, come out, come out, wherever you are. <laughs> Jameson. Mr. Jameson? Oh, boy. <laughs> oh! What happened? Well, Mr. Jameson was here a minute ago, and then he sort of vanished. What are you doing here? Yeah, I thought you were packing. No, Lisa's packing. I just came by to get these vouchers for a free weekend. Flee? I do not think so. Monsieur Jameson is so cheap, he steals towels from his own hotel. Oh, really? Look. Oh, these aren't vouchers. This is money. Money? How did that get in there? You stole the prize money. You're a thief and a murderer. I'm calling the real police. Jeanette. I, oh, I'm sad. I, what did you do it? I mean, if you needed the money, I would. Shut up, Screech. <laughs> this is ridiculous. I didn't kill anybody. <laughs> Tell it to the judge. I didn't kill Mr. Jameson. Why'd you take the money? I didn't. Where'd you dump the body? I didn't. Did you really think you'd get away with this? No, I didn't. I mean, I. I didn't do anything. Take it easy, Darren. He's just a kid. You know, this whole thing is a setup. I just came here to play a stupid game. As soon as Mr. Jameson disappeared, it stopped being a game. Yes, and I want my necklace back. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I am not a crook. Why don't you just ask my friends? All right, we will. Just what kind of a person is Zach Morris? Well, he's the most honest person I know. Well, unless you count the time that he sold fake IDs at school. But his mom grounded him for that. Zach's never really done anything wrong. Except the time he kind of, sort of stole our principal's car. But he gave it back. I know Zach pretty well. And the last thing he would do is steal. Although, you know, there was that one time where he kidnapped Valley's mascot, but they deserved it. Zach's my best friend. I've written down everything we've done together. Let's see. September 12th, 1986. Hey, that was the day he tied me to the roller coaster tracks. Remember that one, Zach? Oh, yeah, you're a real sweetheart. Forgery, grand theft auto, kidnapping. Oh, and don't forget attempted murder. Yeah, as soon as I get out of jail, I'm gonna murder you. <laughs> Just wait till Lisa gets here. She'll tell you hey, something. Lisa! You know, Jameson told her about the vouchers, too. She'll tell you what really happened. Well, then, let's go find Lisa. Look, Lisa, tell these guys about the vouchers. Lisa? She's not here, Fred. Yes, I can see that, Slater. Look. I locked the door from the outside. No, 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 no. See, what I mean is, <laughs> she couldn't have gotten out. Oh, so poof, she's just vanished. Hmm? Oh, so poof, I don't know. <laughs> Poor Lisa. But, oh, Zach. What I am telling you, I left her here packing my suitcase. Well, it looks like she didn't get very far. Hello, what's this? My necklace. Oh, thank goodness. Oh. Ouch! <laughs> but, how did that get in there? Zach, I'm afraid we're going to have to search you. Oh, sure. Go ahead. Search me. What do you think you're going to find? Lisa hiding in my shirt pocket? Nice watch. A little dainty oh. for you, though, ain't it? It's Lisa's watch. Oh, Zach, you fiend. You've murdered my future wife. Lisa would never marry you. Oh, sure, now. You guys are nuts. I'm telling you, I've been framed. We'll see. For now, everybody stay in your rooms. Stay in my room? With that cold-blooded butcher? Relax, Screech. I'll protect you. Aw, oh, Slater, I knew you cared. <laughs> Zach, if you go to jail, I'll visit you every Sunday. Gee, thanks a bunch. So how'd you do it, Zach? Did you poison her lipstick? Oh, whoa, down, boy. Chill out, guys. Something really weird is going on here, guys. We got to figure out how Lisa got out of this room. We? Oui. I'm serious. I mean, how could she get out without the key? I mean, both the door and the windows were locked. Maybe there's a secret passage. <laughs> Give me a break, a secret passage. Like if I turn this candle here, the wall's going to open up. 